is how to play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone. Warning. What you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Uh, you may have also noticed, if you look at the top of the stream, uh, for the past two days, I basically took away the subscriber goal, and then I added it back. And you might be like, well, why did Phil do that? Well, the subscriber goal for this month is 525 subs. Today's the 27th, which means we only have four days left to hit the subscriber goal. What is the subscriber goal? Well, if we hit 525 subs by the end of this month, I'm going to be doing a rage -athon. But anyway, um, we're a far cry from hitting the rage -athon. Like, you know, we've been trying all month to get towards this 525 sub goal, and we just keep dipping subs. So yesterday, out of nowhere, we had someone come in and gift a ridiculous amount of subscriptions. And basically, they were like, man, I really want to help. I want to see if we can hit this goal. So I said, all right, since someone's being so generous, you know, to the point where we gained over, like, over 30 subs yesterday... I said, I'll bring the sub goal back at least to the stream. So I'm, I just care about money. That I just can't help it. I'm so just enveloped in greed and money. I need money. I need money. So as you can see, we're at 465 out of 525 subs. This means we basically need 60 subs in the next four days. Cat, you need to get out now. That place is toxic. Is that going to be achievable? Quite frankly, I don't really believe that it's very realistic unless someone comes in here and is very generous and gives a bunch of subs to people um or unless you guys really step up for those of you who are not subbed you know uh, what i'm hoping for is the best i'm hoping that we'll have some generous parties who will step up and contribute and help some of the people are saying when you say step up that's offensive well to me it's not so let's see what happens you know i'll, I'll leave the sub goal up since this seems like something that people want to push for especially after yesterday um I'll keep, I'll keep it up, all right? Me being very honest and upfront with all of you, because I'm an honest guy, I pride myself on honesty. The truth of the matter is, I'm in the worst financial situation I've ever been in in my entire life. It sucks, I don't like being in this, and I don't like talking about it, but I have to, because that's just the situation I'm in, I need help. Save the pig! <laughs> what the heck? A pig with a party hat. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Piggy. Ziggy Piggy. Save the pig, the game. The whole game you're trying to save the pig's life. Hell! Um, right now, the best way that you could contribute would be to tip me during the stream. Yesterday, quite a lot of people appealed to me to be unbanned from the channel. Some of them, when I went to review, weren't even banned. Which kind of confused the shit out of me. I'm like, why are people asking to be unbanned when they're not even banned? I'm very confused about this. I don't know what's going on. Um, I don't know if it was that they had asked me and other people to be unbanned and someone else had unbanned them. I don't know. It's just confusing that, oh, I'm banned. This, I don't understand. And I go and they're not banned. It's like very confusing to me. I don't know what the hell's going on. Okay. But in other cases, I feel there were a few people that maybe a few months ago acted up a little bit on a stream. And maybe now they, they, you know, they've learned their lesson. Or maybe there were a few people where maybe there were a couple overzealous mods or just some overwhelmed mods. And these people got banned kind of erroneously or unfairly. So a lot of people got unbanned yesterday, uh, and I'm just going to say this publicly, you know, I, I am happy to reveal any situation where someone wants to get unbanned, alright, I understand that these kind of things happen, I am lenient, and I do believe in giving people second chances, absolutely. Give me your money. Let's face it, is a money factory. Please give me your monies. Uh, I don't believe in 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, and 12th chances, which some people have gotten here on the stream. And you're going to find that people who are repeat offenders are not going to be able to get themselves back. But I'm saying, if you're someone who maybe like one or two times made a mistake or something went wrong, um, I'm okay with reviewing that situation and seeing, you know, if maybe we can make a, an exception or whatever, okay? Now, the reason I'm saying this publicly is you may notice a few people in the chat today who have not been here for a while. And if they're back, welcome back. But please understand, you are under scrutiny. The whole point here is to see if you guys learned and are going to abide by the rules. I hope you do. I would recommend today would not be the day to be trying to say something risque. You know what I mean? You probably don't want to bring up negative memes about me or anybody else. It's probably, it's probably a day to maybe lay low a little bit and relax a little bit. And just get back into the flow of things, you know, before you go in head first and start saying, bringing up insulting memes and stuff. Probably not a good idea. I'm just saying, 
common sense. A lot of people don't have it. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm just trying to help you out. All right. I, you know, the last thing I, I hate to see is I unban someone, and within five minutes of them being back, they've already gotten banned again. And it's like, well, uh, so much for that, right? So anyway, welcome back to those who are back. And hopefully, uh, you know, the reason I bring this up, Super Flash 82 was actually one of those people. So that's why it jumped into my head here. So welcome back, and uh, hopefully, uh, you know, we have a good time. Hopefully things are, uh, you know, are smooth moving forward, okay? Give me the money. <laughs> I'm an evil bastard. Like I said, if you guys really want to see me play Madden this year, and someone donates the PlayStation Network credits via the wish list, as you guys know, I have a wish list now. I somehow became the worst person on the internet and an evil e-beggar. When in reality, the only reason I ever had to do that was because people fucked with me. If people never fucked with me, I never would have got to the position I'm in anyway. Not to say that it's not my fault, because there's many bad financial thing, decisions and things I've made over the years that got me into a bad position too. But essentially, it's kind of a 50-50 split here. The people who hate me the most caused me to be in the position to be an e-beggar. And now that I... You know, accept these online donations and give shout outs for them. Now they could criticize me for being an e beggar, even though I, they're the reason I'm, I'm in that position. So it's incredibly hypocritical that anyone would ever criticize me for that, regardless. Okay. Not going to be buying Madden, you know, moving forward. But if someone like us wants to gift it, that's different. Okay. All right. Uh, m Mud a Yucker tip me a dollar. That's the first tip of the day. And he said they want an unban. Oh my God. All right. Since, since I, I'm in a, a nice mood, I'm good mood. I'm going to check this guy out. I'm going to see who this person is. I'm going to see why they got banned. Dude, Muddy Yucker, the one thing you said in the chat was a shout-out to, to two fucking detractors of Wings. <laughs> You're an idiot. Like, you were banned because you literally walked into the stream and the one thing you ever said was a violation of the rules and you got banned. So why are you even... Like, like <laughs> did you not think that I was going to look at this? It's not like, oh, I accidentally did something that I didn't know I was supposed to. You immediately did two shoutouts to detractors of Wings of Redemption, and you think that you're, like, not going to get banned? Are you an idiot? Seriously. Oh my god, they're... I'm toxic. I'm fucked. I'm dead. Like, I don't even know what else to say. Like, like uh, do I unban this guy? Because if I unban him, I mean... <laughs> all right, how about, how about this? Let's all have a laugh. Let's unban this guy. And let's see what he does. <laughs> let's unban this guy just to see what he does, just for curiosity purposes. All right, let's see this. All right, hold on. I gotta, I gotta see this. You know the first thing he's gonna do is probably... All right, anyway, let's see. All right. Goat McGinty tipped me $5 and said, Can I take advantage of your good mood and ask for you to check when and why I was in ban? Goat McGinty? What a name. Um, I guess I could check. Hold on. Well, the thing is, my, my, uh, my chat's been glitching on my laptop recently. So, hint, hint, hint. Um, what it's showing me is it shows you're still banned even though you're not. It looks to me like you were banned months ago. Um... Honestly, it doesn't look to me like you were doing anything too bad, quite frankly. And by the way, you were banned by someone who's no longer a mod. So there you go. Um, I'm gonna make sure, I'm gonna see. Apparently you were banned. You were still banned. So you were not, the ban was not removed. But looking at the logs, I don't know why you were banned. You were banned by a mod who is no longer a mod, and I don't actually agree with the ban, so I just unbanned you. So there you go. See, it's that simple. People are always being dicks and are like, Phil's an asshole and he bans everyone. The truth is that, usually it's not me. Just be honest, usually it's not me. And if people just ask for a review, usually I'll be I'll be fair and I'll review the situation and I'll see if it's a, if it's was warranted in this case. I don't see a damned thing that made this guy get warranted to be banned. I think it was an overzealous mod months ago who hasn't been a mod for a while, so there you go. The honest troll just did a 50 bit cheers. I was wondering why do you start Ask the King streams and so on later than usual? Uh, because I have to review the questions. Like you got what I do is I actually am in my office the normal time that I would be streaming. But instead of streaming, I'm sitting down, I'm reviewing all the forum questions, reading through them, picking the ones that I feel are the best ones for the show. Shout out to King Kozatov, who took me a dollar and said, can I have one last chance, please? No, you've had one last chance like 10 times. Lol. King Kozatov, that's the problem is it, someone like you has proven that sadly mercy doesn't always work because some people just can't learn. They, can't, they have no self-control and can't behave. And you're one of those people who constantly is a negative and toxic influence on the stream where you've got to be bringing up negative shit, you've got to be saying things sly and underhanded and trying to take an underhanded jab at me constantly, and you got to be nasty. And you know, It's just not, it's not appreciated anymore, dude. 
You know, and you had, you had, I'm not even kidding. You probably had about 12. You know what? Hold on. I'll tell you guys. You ready? This is going to be great. You guys ready for this one? This guy has been banned 17 times. <laughs> 17 fucking times. And got back in every time. 17. Do you really think after 17 chances that you've changed? I mean, maybe after chance number 8? If you were gonna change? You know what I mean? Like, good lord, dude. What the fuck is... <laughs> Uh, 17! That's probably the most ever! I can't, you know, like, what the fuck, man? And now apparently King Kozatov tipped another six dollars says, Give me just one more chance! Just one more chance, man! Just one more chance! <laughs> oh my god. He just wants one more chance. That's all he asks, is one more chance. Oh, uh, no. You're not getting another chance. I'm sorry. You're just not. You had enough of this foolishness. That's all it is at this point. It's ridiculous foolishness. Why am I toxic? More toxic. More toxic. Bloy Ripper to me a dollar. Can I be unbanned? Uh, well, let's see. The last things that you said in the stream chat was you, you, first of all, you insulted the looks of my wife. Then you got banned, and then you came back and you called Ahmad a bitch. So, no, you're not getting unbanned because you are an asshole. Like, you actively insulted my wife and then you insulted a mod and you got permanently banned for it you are an actual asshole like if someone spread cheeks as far as they could and you look deep down into the sphincter there's, there's you you're in there all right so you're not getting it you're not getting back to the stream chat because you're an asshole at least the beast toxic oh. <laughs> phil has indoctrinated children who send him money blatantly milking for money it's a money pit it's gone just gone like that in an instant fucking gone i just care about money that i just can't help it i ebay contributions are mandatory but i need your help i am appealing directly to you no decency no respect no common sense no fucking maturity is the guy who just doesn't get reality <laughs> Ha 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 ha!